Royal Guard, no one moves. Oh, you think that's a safe bet? The outlaw, Princess Janna, and her friends have been seen in the neighborhood. You haven't seen them, have you, innkeeper? I mean no offense, your lordship, but with all the taxes these days, I get very few customers. You are aware of what happens to anyone who harbors rebels. Oh yes, my lord. I value my life. We've searched everywhere, Lord Bragan. There's no trace of them. You're not having anything? Uh, not even a little herbal tea? Flaming dragons! When it comes to harboring rebels, no one can hold a candle to Silcar. Yes, thanks, Silcar. You were perfect. Though your chimney could use a good cleaning. I'm famished. What's on the menu? What about Herrick? Isn't he eating with you? His eminence is meditating. Worldly things just don't interest him. Not even my fanger stew? Go and fetch him, will you, Whip? Ugh, I knew it. I knew it was too good to last. Herrick! Herrick! Wake up! They're waiting for us at the inn! Whip! I was just about to pass through the portal of telepathy. On an empty stomach? Come on, let's go have some lunch. I won't need lunch, Whip, on the other side of the portal. Well, my lovelies. What is it you've spotted that I should know about? Ah, the young Shogi. I won't need anything. My spirit will be free from physical limits. I'll travel great distances in the blink of an eye. But Herrick, do it after lunch. Silcar has prepared a real feast and... Oh no, he's gone again. Wait for your chance, then take Excalibur and bring it to me along with the Book of Life. Mm, taste this, choice fanger. Lost your appetite? 
I guess not. Herrick. than that. He, he must be ill. It's all right, my little one. Mama's here. I guess you'll be returning to your precious studies, eh, Herrick? How about a good siesta first? You should at least get a good rest before you go through that portal where you don't eat. Going somewhere, Herrick? Better get cleaned up first. You don't want to make a bad first impression. Now, take the sword. Ah! Herrick, no! <laughs> no, you might hurt Herrick! Quite yourself today, are you, Herrick? What do you want that book for, Griffin? You can't even read. <laughs> what happened, Herrick? It's not like you to let one of these primitive beasts beat you. I'll get him. Miserable donkey. We have them, my lord. The young shogi and the barbarian. What about Janna? I don't know. I only see two. Don't lose sight of them. They lead us to the princess. <laughs> Sure, I'd get him. This Griffin is pretty nimble. He's definitely not like the others. You let him get away with the Book of Life! Yeah! What's the matter with him? Come on, before he really bites off more than he can chew. Oh, <laughs> 
Bill's exhausted. He can't be far. We have to find him. Whip, do you see anything? You're taking too long. Which way? Listen, you spoiled brat. Your great-great-grandfather wasn't even born when I spat my first flame. So change your tune, or you can find your lousy book without me. Easy, Whip. It's bad for your nose. It's not my fault he lost his stupid book. Keep a sharp lookout. If we can find Jana before her friends do, so much the better. One is smarter than the average griffin. Where's Herrick? He... he attacked me. He, he grabbed Excalibur. His eyes were... I don't know, like someone possessed. If you want my opinion, I think all that telepathy went to his head. What telepathy, Whip? You know, that portal thing he was searching for, where you can travel great distances in the blink of an eye, blah, blah, blah. He did that? I thought you two were just kidding around. Oh, he did it. He said he was going through the portal without lunch. Then he closed his eyes and shook like a leaf. Crazy shogi ideas. We'd better talk to Morgan. Whip, go and find him on the island of the shogis and meet us on the beach. Well, you've made short work of my dogs. But let's see how you handle them, master! Ha! Uh, hey! No bragging. It's the griffin who has the Book of Life. This shogi is with us. Uh, are you sure we can trust him, Quodan? As surely as you can trust me. How reassuring. I'm sorry I ate that stew now. Tara! 
We need your help, Morgan. We think Herrick tried some shogi technique, but something went wrong. The telepathic portal. Whip told me. Herrick never should have tried to master it before learning to block out other spirits. Someone more powerful has taken control. Quodan? How? What's he done with Herrick? Quodan transferred another consciousness into Herrick and trapped Herrick in another body. The Griffin! That would explain its strange behavior. You mean that Herrick is inside that creature? And the spirit of the Griffin now inhabits Herrick's body. I can break this spell telepathically, but we must find them both. You're sure he's in there with the Book of Life? Well, have a look! And remember, Shogi, I'm watching you. to help. That sounds crazy, but whatever you say. If he's hiding on the cliff, we'd better go by boat. I'll ride up to the top, in case he tries going back to the forest. <gasps> Don't worry, Herrick. We'll get you out of there. Just hang on until Morgan and Jana get here. destroy your own body. You'll never be able to reoccupy it. Concentrate, Herrick. Open your consciousness. Let me enter. Bragan, he can spoil your telepathic connection, can he? Excellent. He has the Book of Life. As soon as it's in my hands, we no longer need the Shogi. Understood? Herrick! No! Now, Herrick, now! Come back! Now! Herrick? Herrick? Is that really you? I... I, I think so. Shh. It's all right. He got through. Good work. Now, give me the Book of Life. Wait a minute. You might not need those. As you wish. But I thought that it was Excalibur that you really wanted. I'll take what I can get when I can get it. Hand it over. Let me get Excalibur for you. I know how to win Jana's confidence. She's in love with me. <laughs> A bit conceited, isn't he? All right, but make it quick. Hold on! What about the book? Jana may be suspicious if she sees I don't have it. But don't worry, you'll soon have them both. You have until nightfall. I'll be waiting at the Royal Palace. Herrick, are you all right? Oh, I've got a terrible headache and my shoulder is killing me. Oh, but my own body never felt so good. Oh, Herrick, I thought you'd left us forever. He nearly did. Herrick's mental powers are already quite impressive, if somewhat undisciplined. Not many can pass through the portal on the first try. I know it was reckless to try on my own, Morgan. And I never would have made it back without your help. You saved me from a life as a hideous beast! What do you think, Tara? Should I ask Morgan to help me jump into a better-looking body? Whip, you're perfect just the way you are. Really? You mean it? 
Even with my honker, my scaly old hide. Now do you believe me? Oh, you're right. Who'd want to be anything but a dragon? Still waiting, Dragon. Are you really so stupid that you expect Herod to bring you Excalibur? But why not? You told me yourself that I could trust him. That Herrick wasn't himself. The Herrick you let go was himself. Was himself? Wasn't himself? What are you talking about? I don't really expect you to tell the difference yourself. Myself? Himself? <laughs> 